Welcome back to Champs. Are you ready for worship? Let's go!
fall down, you pick me up. When I am dry, you fill my cup. You are my all in all. Jesus, Lamb of God, worthy is your name. 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 Hi friends! Welcome back! Come, hop on! We are going for an sharing us around. And yes, what they said earlier is right. God always provides for all our needs through Jesus. He is our daily bread. Today, we're looking at Jesus as our daily bread. Jesus wants to care for us, protect us, and provide for us every single day. He is always there. But sometimes when we face with a problem, the problem looks so big. Oh no, what should I do? What should I do? Okay, what's the matter? Is she worried? I was asked to represent to my class for a same competition. I am very scared and worried. I heard you train before. It's a love to me, nothing to worry about. You don't understand. I, you have to sing to a very big crowd and my friends are expecting that I will win. I don't think I'm good enough. Oh, don't think about that. Remember your birthday at school? Yeah, I remember. I thought I wouldn't have any friends or the teachers wouldn't be nice. And then what happened? I prayed to God and asked Him for help. And? It was amazing. I got to know a lot of friends. Even the teachers was nice. That's what you should do for the competition. You should pray to Jesus. Oh yeah, I shall pray to Jesus. Outdoor competition. It was amazing. Wow. Because Jesus was with me, I enjoyed singing. I also won first place. Yes, when you look at Jesus, our problem will be so much smaller because God is so big. That is why it's important to go to Jesus every single day. When you eat your food, it gives you energy. In the same way, when you go to Jesus our daily bread, He gives us strength and wisdom. The more we go to Jesus, the more we see Jesus as a big God. The smaller our problem will become. Just like this. This door is so big. But when look at this big wall here, I can't even see the door anymore. In the same way, the wall is like Jesus. It's so big. The dot is like our problems. When we keep looking at the dot, it looks big. But when we put it next to Jesus, Jesus is so much bigger. It's important to always look at Jesus instead of our problems. This is Peter, one of Jesus' disciples. One day after Jesus had done a great miracle, Jesus sent the disciples across the lake while he stayed and sent the people home. After sending the people home, Jesus went up the mountain by himself to pray. 
Meanwhile, in the middle of the lake, the disciples were having trouble. A strong wind began to blow, and big waves began to rise high. About three o'clock in the morning, Jesus came towards them, walking on the water. When the disciples saw that, they were terrified. They cried out, It's a ghost! But Jesus spoke to them, Don't be afraid, he said. Take courage, I am here. Peter couldn't believe his ears. It was Jesus. He called to Jesus, Lord, if it's really you, tell me to come to you walking on the water. So Jesus said, Yes, come. So Peter got out of the boat and walked out on the water towards Jesus. But when Peter took his eyes off Jesus and saw the strong wind and waves, he was terrified and began to sink. Save me, Lord, he shouted. Jesus immediately reached out and pulled Peter out of the water. Jesus said, You have so little faith. Why did you doubt? Jesus and Peter climbed back into the boat and the storm stopped. The disciples worshipped Jesus and said, You really are the Son of God. When Peter looked at the wave and the storm, he got scared. The little dot becomes a big dot. But when he looked at Jesus again, Jesus lifted him and helped him. After Jesus did that, the storm and the problem also left. Wow! Nothing is bigger than Jesus, not even the wind or the wave. Kids, Jesus is way, way, way bigger than everything. Even when our problems look big and tough, just like the wind and the wave, but it is not to Jesus. Nothing is impossible for Jesus, whether it's your exam, your test, or your competition. Focus on Jesus, ask Him for help. Just like in Hebrews 12, to verse 2, it says, Let us only look to Jesus, and He is the one who begins our faith and, and makes our faith perfect. How do we focus on Jesus? By reading His words and spending time with Jesus. Just like this egg, it cannot flow on water yet. But the more we keep praying to God and reading His word, and spend time with Him, the more the egg will flow. The lesson to be learned is Keep praying to God! The more we look at Jesus, the more we see Jesus bigger than everything else. We can surely do all things through Jesus. My two six last night. This then is how you should pray. Let's pray. Dear Jesus, thank you for your amazing love towards us. Thank you for always taking care of us and being with us all the time. Help us to look at you and focus on you, knowing that you are bigger than everything else. In Jesus' name, Amen.
butter, salt, sugar, and corn syrup. First, put the oil in the pot and the fry pan. You pour the popcorn kernels inside the pot. Then you let it pop. Chance, chance, chance in crime.